barbecue family. Thank you guys for tuning in to another episode on our channel. I'm Maddie and this is Kiki and we are Canada's favorite female grill masters. Today, we are sharing our tips and tricks on how to make a delicious menu plan for the week and only have to grocery shop once. Yes, once. We do this each and every week and not only does it save us precious time, it also takes the guesswork out of the dreaded question, what should we have for dinner tonight? And it's easier on the old pocketbook. Producing a weekly meal plan for you and your family doesn't have to be hard at all. And it certainly doesn't have to mean you'll be spending hours and hours in the kitchen or out at your barbecue preparing meals. By the end of this video, you'll be armed with all of the skills you'll need to implement a delicious menu plan for up to four members of your family. And you can start saving time and money each week. Plus, you'll be creating some tasty and healthy meals. You might even want to add our mushroom spinach and goat cheese quesadilla to your menu next week. It is so tasty. Honey, are you ready to do this? I'm ready. Let's go! Let's go! All you need to create a delicious and simple menu plan is a pen, your phone, and one of these weekly planner templates. And some time to yourself so that you can envision how you want your week rolling out. We grab all of this gear and head to the porch so we can gather our thoughts and start letting that yummy inspiration start flowing. We rip off the week before's menu and use it to organize our grocery list into our seven master categories. Produce, bread, meat and alternatives, dairy, pantry items, frozen items, and home essentials. We will list items under these categories once we have determined our weekly menu. It's all about organization here. These categories sometimes even act as reminders for items that you know you're out of, like coffee filters. I don't know why, but we are always forgetting the coffee filters. Now that we have our grocery category set up properly, it's time to start deciding what you and your family would like to eat throughout the week. We create our menus only featuring lunch and dinner with the understanding that breakfast and snacks do not need to be planned out. The key to creating a successful meal plan is being realistic about the week. You don't want to load the menu with recipes that require two hours of prep time because most of the time, everyone wants to just come home from work, quickly make something delicious and healthy with a simple cleanup. We love adding mushrooms to most of our meals since we really feel like mushrooms make meals better. They're meaty, hearty, filling, packed with umami and can easily be added to any meal as a feature ingredient or pairing. You'll see here that we are cooking once and eating that same meal twice. In our opinion, making friends with leftovers is the best decision you can make when it comes to menu planning as it saves time and wastes less food. And wastes less of your hard earned money. Once our menu has been decided on, it's time to list all the ingredients we will need to make these recipes in their designated category. Let's take our mushroom spinach quesadilla for instance. We know that this recipe will require cremini mushrooms, spinach, goat cheese, tortillas, onions, garlic, olive oil, and barbecue rub. So we list those items under each category. Once you do this for each recipe, make sure to add in the items you know you want to enjoy each week that are not necessarily needed in any of these recipes. For instance, I need my morning coffee and would never want to go without that. She's not lying, guys. You do not want to see this girl in the morning without a coffee. Okay, I can't really deny that. <laughs> now that our menu has been prepared as well as its corresponding grocery list, you're ready to head to the grocery store. Since the grocery list is laid out in categories, your shopping experience will be quick and efficient. When you're in the produce section, you're able to focus on making sure you get everything listed in your produce category. No walking aimlessly through the store and going back and forth from aisle to aisle. All of this list making and grocery shopping is making me hungry. It's Wednesday and it says we're having mushroom spinach and goat cheese quesadillas for lunch, so let's get cooking up. All right, let's go get that grill fired up. Yeah. It all starts with chopping cremini mushrooms, onions, and garlic. Place a cast iron skillet on your grill and start sauteing the mushrooms and onions until they become caramelized and golden. Remove the pan from the heat and start building the quesadillas. Place over direct heat on your grill and do not walk away. These quesadillas will cook quickly, so flip them after one minute. Cut into thirds and enjoy. It really doesn't get more simple than that. We love mushrooms because they're a nutritional powerhouse that is a source of important nutrients including vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. 
We encourage you to add them to your menu plan as they are one of the most sustainably grown crops in Canada, making them an environmentally friendly choice. After seeing us make our weekly menu plan, we hope you guys are feeling inspired and ready to make one for yourself next week. We don't know what we'd do without our weekly meal plan. It's something that we refer to so many times during the week and each time we feel so grateful that we put in a little effort at the beginning of the week so that the week can roll out smoothly and with minimal effort. Thanks so much for watching Barbecue Family. Don't forget to like and subscribe and tune in every Friday at 12 p.m. Eastern for a live hangout with us. See you guys then.